And we begin with breaking news out of Monroe, where a wheat field fire is currently burning as fire crews race against the clock and winds to keep it under control tonight. Good evening and thanks for joining us on NBC 16 News at 11. I'm Stephanie Domerat. And I'm John Franke. More than 100 firefighters are working to contain this fire. For the latest on their efforts to bring in NBC 16's Justina Quello, she is live on the scene near Monroe. Justina, how close are firefighters to getting this blaze contained? Hey guys, yeah, things are much calmer out here than what we saw earlier. You can see the flames and the smoke have completely died down, and we're told at this time the fire is 100% contained. Crews behind me are just in that final mop-up stage at this time. You can see there are a, still a few crews on scene, but earlier there were 100 firefighters from three counties. They were all here along with the Oregon Department of Forestry. When you look at the standing wheat behind me and the amount of uh, Christmas trees that we were faced with, uh, it's an extremely volatile um, mixture. And we called out a lot of help quickly so we could get a handle on it before it became Lane County's problem. Fire officials say it started around 6 o'clock this evening when a combine harvesting wheat caught fire. We're told the fire burned about 100 acres of the field along with that surrounding timber. And that steep terrain was the biggest challenge in putting it out. Now, earlier, there were 15 homes on standby waiting to be evacuated if they needed to. But we're told at this time they've been given the all clear crews, as I mentioned, just finishing up that mop up stage. They'll be back here later on this evening to do some perimeter checks and then tomorrow tomorrow morning to make sure things are fully contained. Reporting near Monroe, Justine Aquello, NBC 16. Thanks so much, Justine.